Hi guys, it's Nikki from The Nail Niche again. Hope you all are doing well. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. If you're liking the content, give me a subscribe. And if you're liking this video, give me a like and leave a comment to say hello. In today's video, I have sweet and sour lacquers offering for June's PPU and the theme is Over the Rainbows. <laughs> um, the maker's uh, polish inspiration was by Mosaic Art. And I'm going to leave a little picture up here so you guys uh, know where her inspiration came from. Uh, this is my second time swatching for sweet and sour lacquer and this is my first time doing a video about it so I'm excited. If you guys are new to Polish Pickup, um, it is a, a nail polish website started in 2017, uh, mostly curated to indie makers. So a theme is voted on in the Facebook group and indie makers make a theme uh, based, uh, sorry, make a polish uh, based off that theme for the month. So um, yeah, I didn't start shopping polish pickup until November of last year. So about six months ago, so I'm still quite new to it, but I can't believe it because I missed out on so much, but it's okay. I'm in the light, I'm no longer in the dark. <laughs> so um, yeah, the shop is open from every first Friday of the month and it closes every first Monday of the month. So it's basically open for the first weekend of the month. Some of these polishes have a cap on them, meaning that once it's sold out, um, it's it'll be no longer available. But sometimes depending on how fast the polish sells out, other makers will add more or it's just sold out and you can hopefully find it in a D stash if um it becomes um, one of your lemmings so uh, without further ado actually sorry i forgot to mention they don't only sell nail polish they sell jewelry um nail polish like art uh art tools uh like nail files and things like that so it's not just polish it's curated to a lot of different things so um yeah you guys should definitely uh check it out if you haven't yet <laughs> and um shipping is fairly it's tiered at, at at tiered at different amounts so depending on the amount of polishes that you get uh the shipping will be uh higher or lower so without further ado, let's get into the swatching. Okay, so I'm going to be going in on my first coat here. I just have a base coat on from um, Zoya. I actually am using their color lock step, so I'm just seeing how it works. Um, but going on the first coat here, um, polish applies really, really beautifully. It's smooth, really buttery. Um, their nail line is still showing through the first coat, but that's okay because uh, that's what it needs to uh, build up. Uh, so you can see the glitters through that. Uh, going on on my second coat here as you can see it's getting fully opaque um uh, i think it's a bit uh, the formula is a bit thick but that, i think it's just because i added too much on my brush so once i took that off um it was fine <laughs> so yeah that is uh two coats of a uh, mosaic All right, guys, let me know what you think about uh, the polish in the comments. Let me know if you'll be picking this up. Wish listing starts next Sunday, so that is exciting. You can uh, just wish list a bunch of the, you can put a bunch of the polishes that you're thinking about buying um, into your wish list, and then come Thursday night or Friday morning, uh, you can just add them into your cart and just check out right away so you don't um, lose anything or miss out on any of the great polishes that are being offered. Um, if you guys like this video, uh, give me a like and like I said before, a comment just to say hello even. And um, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.